and I work at the Prince Rupert Health Unit and I'm a new graduate nurse. I work for uh, Northern Health Authority and I've been currently working for one month. When I finished high school, or when I was in high school, I did know what I wanted to do. Um, I, I wanted to, to become a nurse and I actually went into uh, university and college right after high school. When I was younger, I actually had a serious illness and I had to be in Vancouver for a long time and I was with nurses and doctors for, for a lot of um, you know, my childhood and that really inspired me to become a nurse and it you know, made me realize what, what they can do and how they can help others and how, can, how they can make a difference in people's lives. So. Typical day at work, um, it's very diversified, it's very flexible here. Um, right now I'm only being trained in a few of the programs, so um, right now it can look like child health clinics, so immunizations for children, um, uh, sexual health clients, um, you know, high-risk families, maternity home visits, going up to the hospital to see maternity moms. Um, so yeah, it's very, um, it's very diverse, but um, in the next few months I'll be going into more of adult health, so um, communicable diseases and uh, that kind of thing. Hi, Mrs. Smith. Hi, how are you? Good. I just wanted to confirm our appointment for tomorrow morning. Yeah, I really enjoyed the community when I came here for my practicums. Um, everyone seems very active and, and very positive and outgoing, and there's lots of things to do up here. Even though it's a, a smaller town, um, you know, the, the, scene, the scenics are, are gorgeous. Like, you know, the, the bay is right there, and um, there's lots of trees everywhere. There's lots of hikes and um, there's kind of lots of outdoorsy things to do and I, I really like that. So lots of really good restaurants, <laughs> really good food, um, I'm a little more shopping than um, say well my hometown's from Kitimat, so a little more shopping, so that's kind of nice. So yeah, and um, and in public health we actually work um, just day shifts, so Monday to Friday and um, 8:30 to 4:30. So. Um, it's kind of nice, so I have the evening to myself and my partner, and um, yeah, so we can, you know, do other things than just, you know, instead of working all the time, I have some free time as well, so. Hi, you can come into my office now if you want. I love working with people, and um, I, I really love building relationships with people as anytime I can and I, I feel this job in particular as opposed to working in the hospital allows me to do that and um, I love promoting health and um, I'm all about prevention and protection and this is what public health is about so okay there you go So, what brings you to my office today? Well, I actually took a home pregnancy test and it turned out positive. Oh, okay. So, yeah. yeah. Oh, great. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. Some of the previous jobs I've undertaken, um, I've actually worked at Dairy Queen in the summer, and I've worked at a, as a student nurse in um, the Kitimat Hospital, and as a student nurse at Alcan in Kitimat, BC. So, so to be um, a public health nurse, I would probably say, one of the main things to be interested in um, or to have a value for would be um, prevention is the main one, health promotion, um, protection, and just basically, um, yeah, promoting people's health. Um, we do have prenatal classes. Okay. And um, I think they start next week, actually. Oh, yeah. Um, and I would just, you know, advise that, you know, even though a lot of people hear that nursing school is very hard and hard to get into, but I would just say, you know, don't get discouraged. Um, it's, you know, it's worth the wait, even though it's four years for the registered nurse program, but I think it's, it's, it's worth it. And um, if you put your mind to it, and if you're caring and, and you're responsible, then I think um, almost, you know, a lot of people could do, could become a nurse, so. I can definitely see myself working in the health services area. 